vlogmas. I'm still in my jammies. It's eight o'clock in the morning. We've been up since 5 a.m. But we have been very busy. We have been collecting all of our fall decor and gathering it all up on the table. And yeah, we do have a Christmas tree. We did have a little bit of both going on, which it doesn't bother me. I don't think there's any rules that you can't have both out. So we definitely had both because we did host Thanksgiving here. Which I could talk later about that if we get to it. But since we hosted, we definitely kept out some of our fall decor. And now it's time to collect it all. We are very excited to be decorating for Christmas Yay! today. Aren't we? We're going to be putting up the big tree in the living room. We'll probably focus on just the living room and maybe like the foyer area. And then tomorrow, maybe the kitchen. We'll just have to see how it goes. Um, the playroom was a little bit overwhelming trying to do it with all of the kids. So we're just going to see how it goes. But we definitely have a few days to get it all done. So no hurry by any means. We're just really excited. So anyways, I'm going to find some bins to collect all of the fall decor to put it away. So then we kind of just have a clean space and we can go from there. I am sad to see it go because I love my fall decor so much, but it is time. So we're gonna find some bins and get this all tucked away. Are we saying goodbye to the pumpkins? Say bye. Oh, oh nope, that one's glass. Ah, hey, no, <laughs> no. We're just clearing everything out of this corner, all of the toys that we were gonna show you. Macy won this bike yesterday. It was awesome. So we do a turkey day 5K race every year. And they had a drawing for two kids and two bikes. And you were the very first winner. <laughs> so she won a new bike yesterday. Dad, I really like the colors and, and shapes. And I have no idea what these are for. To stand on. It's, yeah, you can do tricks, but not till you're older. But it's maybe just a pinch too big, but by next summer, I bet you'll be riding it. So that was an awesome surprise. It felt like Christmas yesterday, didn't it? Yes, it did. So are you thankful for that? So I'm actually sitting in the driveway right now. I'm gonna be heading to do some Black Friday shopping. I wasn't going to do any shopping because I honestly, when I looked at the ads, I'm like, I don't really see anything that I need to go out for, but it's kind of a tradition. I do it every year, and so I just, I saw one thing. I'm actually gonna go to Menards, which is not like an exciting place to go on Black Friday, but they have dog beds like on super sale, and Bailey could really use a new one, so I wanna see if they have any left. It started at 6 a.m., it's nine, so we'll see. And then it's just tradition, I always go to Target. I'll probably, they have a toy sale, generally it's buy one, get one half off. And then if you spend $50, whoa there, crazy hair. If you spend $50, you get a 20% off coupon to use like at a later time, which I could definitely use because I'm always going there. So I thought I would go check that out as well. But like I said, nothing I really needed to rush out super early this morning. I think nine is still pretty good. So we'll see. I'm only hoping to be out for like an hour so then we can get to decorating. But I'm gonna go to Menards first because that sale ends by noon and I just wanna get there and try to snag one of those dog beds for Bailey. I'm doing this for the dog. Menards is busier than Target. Holy cow. It's never been this full before. There must be some awesome sales. Dog beds are flying off the shelves. Seriously, people are going crazy. But I got two. This one's three dollars. It's really cute. It's kind of small. And then this one's eight, so I'm spending like $10 on two dog beds. So that's awesome. But it is really, really busy in here. I wish you were just a little bit cheaper. Oh my gosh. That is cute, the little shoe shelf. I think this is the one I just saw at Goodwill for $8, and it's 50 normally. So I think it was a good value after all. I honestly just am having a hard time trying to figure out what to get them. Just finished up shopping. It was okay, Target, kind of a bust. 
I did end up spending $50 so I could get that coupon, but I ended up getting like things we needed for our house, like diapers, household stuff, and then a few gifts. I can't show you the gifts because Macy watches all of my videos. All the kids do, really, but Macy and Madden would get their Christmas spoiled if I showed you. So I'm gonna head home. Everyone's excited to decorate for Christmas now, so we're gonna do that. Hello. We're gonna do Vlogmas now. Same to school. Hola! It was the night before Christmas I was closing down for business When the bell on the door jingled once more And then time almost came to a stop But somehow I knew And maybe so did you That everything would change from now on Yes from this Christmas on this Christmas your butt in the background I should <laughs> we decided to put extra lights on we had a few extra strings of lights just to brighten it up even more so he got nominated for that we talk for hours on end and somehow we knew that we'd find something true boys are all sleepy right now. Him too. So I made an emergency run to Hobby Lobby. Well, at least I call it emergency because the tree just, it felt like it was missing something. So I wanted to go peek through all the ornaments. I kind of knew that because we've only had one tree in the past. This year we did two. So we used a lot of the ornaments in the playroom, but now we're doing this one and kind of like a little bit of a nicer theme. So I wanted to go pick up a few things. So I did a quick Hobby Lobby run. I didn't bring the camera because yeah, I just wanted to be really quick in and out. I don't think that I was really quick though, but I picked up a few things. I'll show you what I picked up for the tree and then I better get back to work before the boys wake up. I'm gonna try this year to put these little like berry sprigs in the tree. I picked up a good amount of them, but they were like 80 cents a piece. So I thought that those might just add a little bit of something to the tree without having ornaments. So we'll try those. And then I wanted to get a few more green ornaments. I have a lot of red going on, but I thought that the green in these was just really, really beautiful. So I picked up a pack of those and good thing they're shatterproof. And then I picked up these ones. I really wanted to get more of those big bows, but they were so picked over. Like this was like the best of the best or the 
not the best of the best. This was just kind of what was left over at this point. It's just so picked over, but I thought these were kind of cute. They have the red in it, and I don't know. I just really liked the size of those. And then I picked up that uh, Mary basket. I have a couple of them on the tree already. I really liked how those looked, so I thought I would pick up just a couple more because they had a few, so I picked up just three more of those like tobacco baskets. So I'm going to get to work on this, and then I need to finish up the rest it of the room. It's cold outside. Fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're Everything will be okay. I do like that I added those. I think they're really cute. Just something different besides just the ornaments or like garland or anything like that. So definitely happy about those. I think I got the perfect amount and I think it looks pretty good. We're just waiting to put the star on until everybody wakes up. But what do you think? Does it look good? Yeah. I think it does too. This is our first year having like a, a real like pretty tree and not just a fun ornament tree. So it's all kind of new to me, but it's really cute. I have quite the disaster in the living room, but um, I'm doing it in stages. So I wanted to keep out like everything I plan to use in like the living room. I have my nativity set over here. This is the willow tree nativity set. I always put it on the piano there. So that's kind of my next thing I think I'm gonna work on is the nativity. My mom actually bought this for us from Costco and brought it to Thanksgiving for us. It is ginormous, so I need to find a better place for it. It's blocking my sign, so I don't know that this is the best spot. I just put it here yesterday since we had guests here, but I'm gonna try to jazz up the piano with the nativity set. All I wanna do is spend this holiday with you. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything till we perfect for this week. Tomorrow. but arranging pillows is like the most difficult thing. So I took these off of the couch. I might just set those aside for after Christmas because if you have too many pillows, it's almost hard to sit on the couch and then they just end up all over the floor. So I think this is what I'm gonna go with for now, but we'll see. They're all like my favorite pillows, so I wanna make them all work, but yeah. I don't know. It works. They're really cute. I do like them. Those are like my favorite. They're all my favorite. I, who am I kidding? <laughs>
outside The snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love my husband actually took the older two kids out to run a few errands and I can hear the twins waking up upstairs so I think my time is limited. This has taken pretty much all day just to tackle this main room. I don't remember it ever taking this long before but yeah I'm kind of beat from decorating. It's about 310 so I think I'm going to start cleaning up some of this mess. We still need to hang the stockings. I hear the twins knocking up there. Hang the stockings. I'm not done. I want to kind of look through everything that I have still to try to finish the mantle. But I better go get the boys and we're going to have to maybe call it quits for today. But we've made a ton of progress. I am loving how it's all coming together. The Christmas songs that we love. And in a while we're going to go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire. Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, so beautiful Ethan was already playing with my decorations. I knew that he would, so I cannot have anything breakable over here. So, well, it doesn't, I don't know. I'm not sure. I need like a bigger lamp or just to take the lamp out altogether. Maybe a bigger lamp at some point. Not probably anytime soon. So yeah, it has to be all like non-breakable items. And I'm trying to stick with like red and white and kind of all of this area. And yeah, you guys get it. So what do you think? He's grumpy. From this angle, it looks really pretty. I think I want to add like one more thing on each side just to kind of fill up the mantle a little more. But yay, I'm loving it. I'm gonna show everything in my full house tour, so I'm not gonna go around and show you everything today, but I think this is my last piece of decor for today. Oh my gosh, I am in love. That was the first star, second star of Christmas. Ready? Yeah. Don't, no, don't do that. Oh man, here we go. I heard this one light up. No. Boring. It works. Uh, All right, give me a two, and this game is O V E R. They're playing. Sorry, I am pretty much wiped out from the day of just shopping yeah, and decorating. It was exhausting. So. I'm probably gonna wrap up today's vlog. We are gonna head to a lighted parade here in the next 45 minutes. Yeah. So I maybe yeah. will add a few clips of that. Hopefully we'll see Santa tonight and a bunch of fun Christmas lights. But anyways, thanks for following me along today. I hope you enjoyed Sorry. it. Make sure to thumbs up this video and I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Bye.